up guys, another video review for you. This time we look at, we're taking a look at Fans Project's second release in their uh, Retro Future Glacial Lord line. Uh, and this is Fangro. Uh, again, unique character, totally new. Um, as you saw with Tail Club, again, very G1, very blocky, very solid. We'll take a look at his minion in here in a second. But as you can see, he is a saber tooth tiger esque saber tooth cat. His mouth does open. But you can't see that his gun is inside, or not his gun, there's a the peg is inside. His tusk can also move, but that's for uh, for gun mode, which we'll see later. But yeah, he is very cool looking. Very obviously some kind of saber toothed cat. Do really like the face on him. I think it's really cool. Take a look at the little minion dude. As you can see, again, totally different from Tail Clubs. Obviously the figure itself is, you know, basically the same, but all the molding is different. Even the head molding, the chest, everything is different. It's just the same exact shape. Because they're all they are all interchangeable as well. So yeah, there's him. For his Beast Rider mode, what you want to do is slide this panel back and just slot him. He does sit pretty low. You can like have him grab his ears. I don't like that. And have him ride like that. So there they are like that. Again, you can have him inside during transformation. We'll just get him folded up. You can see he's green instead of I think orange for a tail club. But again, you can just have him sitting in there, just fine. So yeah, to transform him, I'm going to pull the tail off. Come on, why are you being difficult? Uh, pull it straight up, it pegs in right there, and slots in right there. This is whoop, half of the gun. Pull the head off, pull the uh, post up, flip up the fangs, open the mouth. There's a peg hole up in his uh, upper the roof of his mouth. I'm gonna plug that gun up in there, close his mouth, lower the tusk. Well, you don't have to, but you can position these however you want, but I lower the teeth like that to keep everything flush. And that's gonna be his gun. Put that to the side, come over to him. Fold the neck back, extend the torso, whatever you want to call it. Fold these legs up thusly so they're clear. He sits flat. Fold these legs back to expose the fists. Oh, as far as stickers, this guy, um, these were on. I put one of these on both of these kneecaps, the stickers. And. That's it. Yeah, that's it. And where's my ton on these guys, this guy either? Tusker, there was a lot. So we're going to take the companion, plug him in, and there we have Fangro in his robot mode. So again, total G1, total blocky, but the quality on these guys is top notch. Take his gun, plug it in. Same basic articulation as a uh, tail club, shoulders go all the way around, and that's it. Then the fists can go up and down for the transformation. But that's it, there he is with his gun. I love his gun. It's a saber tooth tiger head with a gun barrel. Awesome, I love that. So we'll just unplug that for now. So for his limb mode, he is like there's always a default configuration for these guys for the Scramble City. The tail Club is supposed to be the figure's left leg. He's supposed to be the figure's left arm. Um, again, they're Scramble City, so you can do whatever the heck you want with them. But to get this guy into arm mode, what we're going to do is disconnect the head from the gun. Get that all back to normal. 
Uh, this gun becomes the tip of the combined gun. Uh, fold that down, fold this in, peg it on. Um, there's just a slot here and it just there's a cut in there and it just slots in. Easy peasy. Um, there is articulation in his uh, neck too. Uh, we're going to... I always forget how to do this. They're going to face this way and you want to fold them around that way. So fold them this way and then fold the hands back down and around that way. Rotate it here so that the peg is facing that way and that's it. You would slot it on there and that's his arm. Easy peasy. Fist goes in there. Um, let me get Tail club's foot, just so I can show you a foot mode. Collapse that down. Fold this head up, just like that. Plug it in, and there you have a foot mode. So again, these guys can be very quickly and easily swapped around, which is awesome. Did I do that right? Yeah, because you don't want that facing up. Yeah, that's right. So yeah, this is foot mode. So yeah, again, seriously, you guys really, even if, if you like G1 figures, you will love these guys, plain and simple. If you hate G1 figures, then you can very easily pass on these guys. But I mean, everything about them is just awesome. They're so much fun. I just can't say enough good things about these guys. at this. So you see how fast I can just transform him? One of the great things about G1. So yeah. Seriously. When these guys, when you see these guys go up for sale, pick them up. You will not be disappointed. I guarantee it. So yeah, this has been the video review for Fans Projects Retro Future Line. Glacial Lord. This is Fangro.